Okay, so here I am uh, putting on the final touches of the rainbow trout. We bring the, we press out the rainbow trout and let it dry out. And then we put hangers on the back, sign and date them. This is just dried clay. And so then we painted it green and then yellow and red and then white. And now what I'm gonna do is uh, put on a little red to highlight the fins on the rainbow. And later on, when these are all done, we're gonna bring them next door and put on all the little black dots on them. Um, so they come over here, they get, this is called underglaze. It uh, comes in a bottle like this. It's um, basically uh, colored clay and it goes on the raw clay to fire it and then bring it up to about 1900 and something degrees and then put a clear glaze and fire it a second time and then that gives it a nice shiny and brings out the color you know after we fire it, it looks just like this so when we put the clear glaze on it it'll be really nice and uh, clear and it's totally sealed so we kind of offer it outside and uh, so we'll just let that dry a little bit and then this is our new spray room uh, the old one was shrink wrap you know what you put around boats you couldn't see through this stuff at all and then we had white and then we had a clear that you couldn't see through um, so this is called Lexan it's really expensive and uh, so now while I'm sitting in here I can see all, all kinds of things going on like out here this is kind of cool um, I've been feeding the birds here for 36 years and uh, so what I've done was we put a window uh, right here and uh, now I can shoot the birds out here if I can get this thing going. Oh uh, well, I guess that'll be for another issue, huh, of great pottery. But yeah, so there's uh, some of my bird feeders out there. And, uh, and so I could just look at them. It's real cool. I have a bigger lens too. Um, I just love our birds. We got the regular seed, the suet, and uh, uh, the small stuff. Well, anyway, that's it in a nutshell. <laughs> Bye.